Hey guys, it is Michelle and today we are doing an outfit of the evening dinner date. Um, going to a really nice European restaurant in the area that's absolutely delicious. It's a little on the fancier side, so I get to dress up a little bit. So I'm really excited about that. On my lip, I'm wearing Marc Jacobs Rouge. On the lids, I'm project panning um, schnauzer still. And I covered it with a little bit of um, Vegas Strip by Physicians Formula. Wear my typical liner by Hard Candy, and of course my Manga Mascara, loving it. But I'm project panning a moisturizer. I think I need to stop because like I've just blotted my skin and I still have shine. So it's not working for me. We'll talk about that more in the project pan. So um, it's for face and body, so I'm going to use it as a lotion, I guess. But enough about that. Um, let's get to the rest of the outfit. I'm wearing my typical earrings and I'm wearing my Michael Kors buckle bracelet. But to the rest of said outfit. So um, on top, I am wearing this gorgeous faux fur from Jennifer Lopez. I bought this at Kohl's quite a few years ago for like $10. It's probably my favorite find. It was actually under 10. I think it was like nine and change when I found it. It's like 90% off after the um, holiday. Well, after the season, I normally buy after season. You can take it and if you close it, it looks like this. It's got this really cute, um, I don't know, angle on it. But it's super comfortable actually for a faux coat. It's very, very warm. This was that coat that a few years ago I had to do that video about because my pronunciation of the word faux um, wasn't right and it actually started a controversy about this jacket. But, you know, it's a different um, story. But this is a beautiful jacket. It looks so luxurious. I mean, I, I either really love the fit of the Jennifer Lopez collection or I really don't um, at Kohl's. Her fabrics are just absolutely beautiful. But... They don't always fit properly. Now, to the rest of the outfit. I'm just going to take the jacket off momentarily. Mm, we're gonna, I don't want to put it on the floor. Put it here. Okay. So, this dress I actually bought at... Um, this one came from TJ Maxx, if I do remember properly. And I normally don't do very well on clothing there but this piece i love the little peplum you can see it's got this gorgeous little peplum style which is very flattering and just about any body type i love that it has this gorgeous little high neck halter i think my bra is showing not so good let's bring that in bring it in it's gonna show a little bit regardless but i love the neckline um the arms can use a little I'm still working on that. It's part of my New Year's resolution. They're getting there. It's getting a little better. Um, slow progress, but progress nonetheless. Um, it's a very flattering fit. I like where it hits, and it's very um, figure-hugging as well, which, I mean, you know, it, it doesn't hurt. I really like the way it, it fits. It's very, very pretty. Now, for the shoe, um, I did a more modest heel because there is a lot of ice outside. So, um, you've seen this one before, guys. This one is from Payless. They had a white version I wish I could have grabbed, but um, I missed out. But it's a really good heel, especially for a starter. This kind of heel I can go all day in. It's super comfortable. I can run in it. I could do jumping jacks in this heel. Like, boop, 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 boop. I don't want to do it because I'm wearing a dress. But this one is super, super easy to walk in. Oh, do, 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 do. That's why I love this heel. This is the, um, I do wear higher ones, but this is the one that I like to, um, this is the height I'll wear the most often at work because literally it doesn't matter. Um, I can do anything in these. Whee! It's very comfortable for me because, you know, it's a good heel. I love the detailing on it. Super cute. It's got that old 50s vibe to it. 
absolutely adorable little scuffing on it, but I can buff that out. But yeah, and I got those at Payless for like maybe $20, something like that. So now I wouldn't be an outfit of the day without the walk. So I'm gonna walk without the jacket first and then we'll do the walk with the jacket. love this. As you guys know, um, I tend to like wearing um, red dresses more often than the little black dress. Um, I think it looks good. I am very pale, but I think it looks really nice against my skin tone. But red's one of those colors, like, I think it looks great on everybody. But you gotta have the confidence behind that. That's what I love about this one. And the fact that it's a fun little peplum, it's beautiful, it adds curves to girls that don't have them. It hides problem spots for girls that have problem spots. It's just absolutely adorable. Now, to shed jacket. This is a really nice one. Pluck out the hair. Very flattering. It's like Hollywood, old school Hollywood inspired. It's like being on the red carpet in old school Hollywood. Oh, Elvis, hello, how are you? Oh, James Dean, Marilyn, beautiful as always. <laughs> Super sexy but very sophisticated. Just, that's what I like. I like to be sexy, but a sophisticated because I feel like today so many girls feel that the need to show more skin is what makes a woman sexy. And that is not the case by any means. Um, for those of you who watch the channel, you know this. You know, leaving a little bit to the imagination, but having confidence, and you can show off, um, you know, your legs or whatever you know, body part you're loving, but don't do it all at once. If you wanna show off your legs, show those off. If you wanna show off your chest or your neck area, show that off. Doing it all at once makes it look trashy. So, you know, in my opinion, anyway, I think there is an art to like how they dressed back in like the 50s era and stuff because they had that sexiness, but it was done in a very sophisticated, elegant manner, and I love that. Anyway, guys, I hope you enjoyed my outfit of the day, and I'll see you in the next video. Take care. Bye.